Bang! You guys came through yesterday. What's up? It's your boy Lex Money. In today's video, we're going to find out exactly how much ICP you need to be making one ICP every single day. Now, before we do get into that, I want to say a big thank you to everybody who did support the channel yesterday. We got to 150 likes. Let's try and push that to 175 today. Let's get it. Right, what is up, everybody? Happy Friday. We are finally at the weekend. We can finally take a take a deep breath. Now, quick plug before I do start, guys. I'm going to be doing a $50 giveaway. Maybe I'll give it to you guys in ICP. You can let me know. But what you have to do is go and follow my Twitter. Then also go and follow the Instagram as well, guys. Go and DM me ICP in my DMs on Instagram with a screenshot that you have followed both the X and the Instagram. And maybe Sunday, I will do a little live draw on here. I'll just scroll through my Instagram and show you guys, like, close my eyes and pick one of you. Now, Bitcoin is hovering around that crucial zone at 60 K. It was at 62k last night, guys. And we did say in yesterday's video there was going to be a big resistance zone at 62k. What the hell's going on? Now we check out the members club, guys, and you can see here that yesterday at 11:30, I did post to say, right, we are in the resistance zone channel for Bitcoin. We need to be careful if we're trying to stack up our longs in this zone. And also something to note is that there is external liquidity to be caught at 58k. Usually the market makers like to sweep this liquidity here, guys. And I mean, 58k could be a great zone for us to be getting our next level of longs on being that it would be the bottom area of the channel and it will be printing a technical higher low for bitcoin so that is something to look out for and remember guys the members club is not only a fantastic community of lovely sexy people but we also are killing it with the trades we got 109 percent sold trade last night and then also one of our members did close a 657 percent bitcoin long now i know a lot of you guys are thinking that this guy is turning into an advert i'm not trying to be an advert guys i'm sorry but all of you guys need to take care of yourself as well, regardless if it's monetary or if it's just for your personal well-being, guys. Now, 888 rule, eight hours of hard work, eight hours of good sleep, and eight hours spent on friends, family, faith, health, hygiene, hobbies, soul service, and smiling. Nice. Okay, so a lot of us don't take care of, of our health enough. We don't take care of our mental well-being, guys. And personally, I'm like guilty of this eight hours sleep thing here. I, I just don't sleep, okay? So I'm trying to get better with that. Please can all of you join me on the journey to making sure that holistically, we are all feeling better as a community. I want you guys to succeed and it is important that we do make sure we're doing stuff for ourselves and we don't just live to work, work to live. Now, take care of yourself, but also take care of your crypto because if you don't have a ledger, if you don't have a cold storage, hot storage is one thing. If you don't have a cold storage, guys, you are, okay, you're, you're, you're you're setting yourself up to fail. Now, you don't want to be leaving your crypto on an exchange. There was a coin. One of the members actually did say, right, what's happening with this coin? And you couldn't trade it on pretty much any exchange. I think maybe there's one exchange that you could trade it on. And when you do leave your crypto on an exchange, if their price volatility or the price impact is too high, they can really say, right, you can't swap it for USDT. You can't send it to another exchange. Whereas if you have it in a cold storage, then maybe you could go send it to a DEX and you are fully in control of your crypto. You can go and swap it. You can do the slippage, pay the gas freeze. Don't show people your keys, okay? Because I will steal your crypto. I will take it all and I will 200x leverage it, okay? And then I'll take that profit and bet it on black, right? Don't risk your crypto. Now we see positive news for Bitcoin, for crypto as a whole, every single week, every single month, even when we are in negative sentiment zones. President Putin signs law legalizing Bitcoin and crypto mining in Russia. We already know that Russia probably own way more crypto than we all are aware of. But people are going to say this as well, right? If Trump wins, then, you know, crypto goes up. If Kamala wins, crypto goes down. China unbanning crypto with... Uh, Russia legalizing mining with maybe presidential elections going the way that people think it's going to go with all of the new ETFs with countries now using it as legal tender, right? Bitcoin never needed that. So what everyone's saying, oh, you know, this is bullish for crypto. If this doesn't happen, then it's bearish, blah, 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 blah. If Germany sells, you know, uh, 1 billion of Bitcoin, it's all over. Guys, we've never needed it, okay? So obviously now we're at a higher price, so the volatility will take a bit more price action. But this whole time, the cycles have been repeating, they have been going to plan, and they haven't really deviated from the cycle yet. It's positive, but we've got to look at the ugly sometimes as well, guys. Look at those sell orders, okay? What did we say was going to happen? I don't know when this guy put these sell orders in. I mean, this image was posted today, but we did say we are expecting some sell pressure at around 62k. Looks like someone has placed 
12k Bitcoin sell orders between 61 and 62 point. 5k ish you can go on coin glass you can go on the coin glass website for yourself to check it out but people are trying to short it once that does get dealt with guys we could probably go to the upper area of the channel pretty easily but that is a lot of selling pressure to get through but once we do get through it guys it looks like we are on the edge you guys are probably so sick of me saying oh my god it's nearly time it's nearly time but it is nearly time okay this time is like the boring time where investors lose hope investors say i'm out of the market nobody knows what's going on and really nobody knows what's going to go on in the short term to mid term i have faith that crypto is going to get adopted, that crypto is going to expand long term, as well as the altcoin market cap for the top altcoins, not the shit coins. But for me, this is only a matter of time. And usually the greater the compression, the greater the expansion. So for us to say, oh my God, why is Bitcoin not broken out yet? Why have altcoins not broken out yet? If anything, it makes me more bullish to say we're going to have a bigger move when we do break out. Now, ICPZ, is there a way to find out how many ICP you guys can lock up for eight years to draw one full ICP a day? Yes, there is. First of all, if you're not using the internet computer, if you you don't go on icp dashboard if you don't use the ecosystem start to use it start to learn it become intertwined with the icp become one with the icp and it makes your life a lot easier you can estimate your annualized rewards guys and you can go all the way from like what is it one year maybe yeah zero years 0.5 one year blah, blah 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 so you can see here if you do stake in the internet computer in the nns for eight years then you can get right now 14.7 percent this was higher okay the more that goes in the less percentage returns you're going to get but if you do stake now then you can get that locked in 14.7 percent now if you wanted one icp a day what calculation is it? All you have to do is do 365 days because you want one every single day and you divide it by 0 0.147. So if we do that on the calc, that is going to mean that you need, bah, 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 you need 2,482.99 ICP staked in the neuron for eight years to be getting that one ICP every single day for eight years. That is nice, right? How many of you guys are doing it? How many of you guys have been staking your ICP for eight years? How much have you got staked for eight years? Let me know in the comments. The total three altcoin market cap, guys, is coming up to that level of resistance, as we did say, right at the median of this handle that we have been printing. Remember, key area to hold is around $440 billion. Are we going to break this right now? Are we going to find resistance and come back down to the lower area of the channel? We're going to have to keep a close eye, but right now I need to see 600 billion get broken for altcoins for us to return bullish and then maybe hold this as a new support now, i've spoken to a few of you guys in the comment section and in the members club as well and we've been talking about the icp returns now now we've been getting mixed reviews about the price targets is 150 too much is it too little well it doesn't really matter guys because i've said this to you in so many videos but i will remind all the newbies that we'll be getting out before our top price target guys okay so yes we're gonna have some sell levels at 50 We've been getting ICP from sub $5. That's going to be a 10x. We'll be getting out before $100 and we will be getting out at $150 if we do get there with a little moon bag to go past it, guys. But from where we are now, I mean, it's 600% to 50. It's a 12, 13x to 100 and it's a 20x all the way to 150. And if you missed my sell target video, then I'll leave a link and you guys can go and check that out in your own time. But we did discuss what our sell targets are going to be and why we will be getting out before $150 because we have got such amazing buy prices at this time so you guys can let me know what your sell targets what your exit levels are going to be in the comments what is your exit strategy but boom that's it guys if you made it this far please be sure to support the channel by smashing that like button we need 175 and then also go and drop me a sub if you're not part of the family already guys enjoy your weekend i'm gonna see you tomorrow peace